What's the story? Rain man here calling from Cork. Sorry about that, bro. I just, I just, I just see a pat and I go for it, you know what I mean? <laughs> Look at this fella here, Citroen Sacks off for sale. Put down about 20 euros for that. I'll take the number there and I'll strip it down for parts for my Glenza. Six. What the fuck? Is that a six or an eight? Six. That's it, that's it. My Glenza, boy, she's a fucking beaut, boy. I swear to God. This, this, this girl, no. She can go from not to like 63 in like three seconds. Not a bother on it. I drove from Cork to Limerick to that session that the boys are on about that I'll talk to you in a minute about. I'd say in about 25 minutes. She's a sub woofer, I swear to God, you'd hear in Mayo from Cork. Enough about Stacy. That's what I call her. I'm here to talk about this whole fiasco about the bin in the tin like. I was there in the night, I wasn't drinking because I was driving and I heard all the shams and all the, the boys going on about it like basically this thing between Galway and Limerick is like it's chase play like I remember I was 12 when I was doing stuff like that do you know what I mean? Be into harder stuff now like stuff that those boys can dream about in their wildest dreams did you ever see The Wire? Ha! I'm laughing at The Wire boy I'm looking at them and I'd be like ha! Be like like lollipops and uh, and candy sticks and stuff. Boy. You want to see the stuff that we go through in Cork, boy? I I I I I I can tell you now. Cork is broken down into tufts, and there's a reason why I have a pocket knife in my bedroom that my mum don't even know about. There's a reason for that. It's because I own the biggest tough. I'm on the biggest tough. I am the biggest tough. I'm the tough. I'm the most fertile tough that you're gonna see in Cork. Right? And I know I'm going on a tangent again. What I'm saying to you is I'm going to be there at the session in April as well. And I'll tell you boys, cock is in. Cock is in. We're here. We're here, boy. And we're here to establish ourselves. So I see you then, lads. So you better be ready.